So this this will be the plan. So that was quick and awesome and I think we will not have any problem opening it up like in two seconds or a bit more. I really do enjoy the fact that it's two by two meters and probably we could even do it by having some Spanish beer or something. All we need to do now is understand will it be the same to tear it down? Will it be those same two seconds or will it be just nightmare? Who knows? Let's see. So easy at the first try, but I'll get it. I'll get it. We are going to Spain. Yes. Finally, only two more days. Oh no, just one day. Tomorrow is Sunday. After that, Monday morning, we're doing COVID tests and hopefully they're negative. We're passing Lithuania without knowing our tests because Lithuania doesn't ask for the tests and then before entering Poland we'll actually know will we travel this year to Spain or not but that's okay we are risk takers and I think I hope I believe it's gonna be all right we bought a tent we bought uh, this very very cool gas burner with six with six gas cans yes and we're pretty much ready to go. Okay, this is our plan. I'm trying to do this and I only have one chance because I only have one map. So we're going to start from somewhere here. This is our city over here, Latvia. Well, this week was a little bit hectic. It's just because we had so many things to do. On Monday, we had to go to another city to get ID card for our son. And our plan is in five hours time to cross all the Lithuania, stop at the border of Poland, wait for the COVID tests, and then hopefully cross all the Poland, no, not, not all the Poland, but just a middle, somewhere in the middle, we could stay for a night. That's the first day, day number one. Then on Tuesday, we actually shot a wedding. Yes, we shot a wedding. Then we had to do a haircut, not for just for me, but for kids as well. My daughter cut the hair on half, actually. It was much, much longer and now, well, things changed. Then we're crossing the border and hopefully we can get to the border of France with, where is it? Well, it's somewhere here. So it's day number two. Yes, then we shot another wedding, then, yeah, pretty much we got uh, the car fixed. We actually went to Cash and Carry to this promo base and bought a lot of different kinds of foods that are not uh, necessary to put in the fridge, but just, they're just okay with, they're just okay. And then, third day could be to cross all the fronts, and if we do that, it's done. We are in the Spain. Our budget for the whole trip is around 2000 euros. We can travel as much and as long as we can we can with this money. That's the cool thing. We don't have an end date for this trip. Well, we sort of have, but not exactly, not an, not an exact date. So we can probably stretch this out to maybe 20 days, maybe longer. I don't know. We'll see. From this border, we're going to Valencia staying there for a bit relaxing charging our batteries all kind of batteries and then probably we'll go to the south this is where we're going to have a beach time well actually i'm pretty glad we're going to spain because mostly latvian weather is something that bothers me a bit i i kind of associate latvian weather with this particular view and I know, right now it's very nice outside, but after three months it's going to be back. The fall, the winter, cold weather, dreadful rain, snow. Ugh. So now we're going to, I hope, hot Spain. I hope. We also did buy a food for our cat. Her name is Asia, and she'll be staying with my wife's dad, so she'll be okay. 
So that's it guys, this was our second episode of preparing to go to Spain. So stay tuned, subscribe, check out the comment section, leave a comment. Where would you go now with a car? And are we crazy to do this? That's it.